Okay, this video is for the opening of Act 3. And this is just the four couples. I'll ask Michelle if we can throw in um, Peppy and Lolita. And it's a tap dance, very short, cute, fun. Um, in your rehearse score, it would be opening Act 3, number 18. There are several other pieces in front of that, but this is the one we're so right now going to dance to after intermission. Okay, I'm not going to do it um, strict to music or timing or tempo. I'm just going to show you the steps and in the order that they come. And we start with a simple Charleston. Your arms are going to be the chicken arms or Bobby Maisie and I call it breaking the heart, heartbreaking, right, or chicken arms. So this is a small Charleston. You have your tap shoes on, by the way. Um, so Charleston, one, two, three. Do that again. And last time, two, three, four. I will turn around and do it the other way in just a moment. From there, we learned trenches one time when we were doing tap. These are going to be small, kind of running man trenches. It's going to go right, so you got a toe tap in there, toe, a bunch of those, not going to, um, I'll tell you exactly, one, two, you do it, one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight. you end there, that's exactly how many you do. Next, we're going to do the Lindy, which we've been working on, you're going to go to the right first, the left, I'll change, rock, change, rock, back, I'll change, rock, back, and then you're going to do this, I'm going to call it, there's not a professional name for this, it's going to be called the goofy eel movement, stay there, stay there, and you're going to do something like, like a whoop, whoop. you're so going to enter me kind of, out, I'm not going to be in that, it's supposed to be a goofy movement, kind of silly, if you've seen some of the videos, they sometimes do these little silly movements. Um, if you can wake up, you could join me for the last part. Okay. Um, then we're going to paragonal. And from the front, that looks like this. Um, I'm going to start with my right. Heel, toe, toe, heel. Heel, toe, heel. Heel, toe. times and it, it will build but we don't care about that right now after your last paradiddle right jump out in. so it's a jump out slide together right after that if you're a girl you're gonna turn to um, Charleston this way as you turn you're gonna hit hands so it'll be a bam or a clap back. Now this time when you do the Charleston, you're going to go opposite arm down, touch the floor preferably, and back up. Clap hands, bam. Clap hands, bam. Okay. If you're a boy, you would have just done a slide. Charleston, so you're turning to the right. Okay. Charleston, clap hands, now, this piece could repeat again. It could repeat five more times is how it's written. I don't know what we'll need. So I'm going to do all those steps again, but I'm going to face that way. Just so you can get, I don't know, I think it's better when I'm facing this way. All right. So you'll hear this da, da, ba, ba. You got Charleston with chicken arms or heartbreaking arms, and you got Charleston. You do that three times. Bum, bum. There was your third time. Go into a running man trench. Lindy. I don't know how many times to do that. I'm just giving you. I'll, I'll slow down 
on that, Lindy. There's also a tutorial out there that I have posted for you. But anyway, Lindy is all lap, right, rock, back, and step. Okay, can you come up with some goofy eel looking move? Something like that. Parrot Diddle, also a tutorial out there that's done by someone else. Very nice, but I'll show it here again. Right heel, right toe, right toe, heel. Left heel, left toe, right. So it all happens on one side, which is kind of nice. One time jump out, slide together, and you're ready to Charleston hit that hand. You'll do it much better than I because you're younger in better shape, right? Okay, so that's basically the moves you need to practice for opening act three.